this where a manager really sort of earns his corn in many ways, trying to pick the boys up and, and get them going again. Well, do you know what? I mean, they're a terrific group of players, so they'll not need much picking up. They're very conscientious. They're very hardworking. They know that the other night was was a disappointment for for each and every one of us. Not uh, that that we lost the game. I mean, I just think uh, there certainly wasn't the margin. Uh, between the teams that, that the scoreline showed, but ultimately, you know, we made mistakes and we get punished by by a quality side, and uh, so we have to make sure that we cut out those mistakes. And when we create chances, as we did, that we take them and we're clinical. And uh, so there's no fairy dust and magic wand. It's hard work and it's looking to get out there with a smile on your face and go and win your games. Obviously, getting close to the back end of the, the transfer window now. Um, any news on the possibility of Carlos Vela? Well, I mean, I think everybody knows that we've obviously got an interest in bringing Carlos Vela to the football club in loan. And uh, again, it's not rocket science to know that there's only a few days left of the window. So uh, certainly Arsenal and, and Arsenal Wenger will, will make a decision on that in the next couple of days. And I'm sure, as they've always have been very courteous with us, then we'll be the first to know. And if it's the case that we get the green light, then we'll look to act upon it. And, and if not, then, then there we go. The report linking you with Sean Wright Phillips as well. Is there anything in that? Right? Yeah, I mean, listen, I think there'll be reports linking us with a number of players. It's fair to say that uh, we are in the market to try and bring one or two in. Uh, I could sit here and be evasive and what have you, but we would love to, to add to the squad we have. It would be remiss and, and naive of me, really, to, to be mentioning in other names. Uh, Carlos Vela has been mentioned because it was, it was well documented at, at the outset. Uh, but, as I say, to mention anybody else, you know, we're not the biggest and, and most powerful club in the league so we certainly wouldn't want to be losing out to, to anybody else because we've made our targets known so if and when we've got anything concrete or positive you'll be the first to know as always I'm sure you've been keeping a good eye on the Asia Cup as well and um, career obviously out now and Chung Yong Lee at some point will be coming on but I think there's a third and fourth place playoff to be played as well. yes it is I mean so in, in, in that respect the, the semi-finals you know as much as uh, they didn't make uh, much difference in terms of when Chung Young Lee returns. It was disappointing that they lost out in penalties to Japan. But yeah, Chung will be back with us on Monday. Uh, be available obviously for the the Wolves game on on Wednesday if he's fit and well, and uh, and we'll take it from there.